great turnout. Thank you guys, first of all, everyone here for coming out, all of our friends and everybody we know. We don't know all the new faces. Thank you so much. Today is July 21st. It is the 25-year anniversary of Appetite for Distraction today. So thank you so much for being here. I just want to thank uh, Nell and Jerry and all the staff here from Tom and Jerry's for letting us have this here. We appreciate you guys really having us in here. I want to thank also all these guys that are going to be up here on stage tonight paying tribute to this unbelievable record. These guys worked very, very hard. We uh, started planning to do this show about a year ago in uh, June of last year. And it was months and months of learning and just digging in. And I, I really appreciate these guys all doing it. Uh, so thank you, gentlemen. We have uh, Michael Fasaro from the Van Barometer here down on the end. On guitar, Mr. Justin Monteleone from the Pawn Shop Roses here on guitar. Michael Vlander and Foster Child and Octane on the bass. Our brother Bobby Perillas here from Octane and Foster Child. My name is Brian Quinn. Thank you. And we have uh, four. Uh, we have three singers now tonight. This is a very close friend of mine. He sings with my brother's band up in Northeast Pennsylvania. His name is Johnny Dobosh, and I want you to give him a big, warm welcome. So we have this project. Hopefully, we're going to do more than one show. We didn't learn this whole record to do one one show. So we'd like to carry this a little bit further. But we're, thank you all for being here. We really appreciate it. This is a long time in the making. So without further ado, when rock and roll is alive and cocaine was still good for you. <laughs> this is Appetite for Destruction.
later. Johnny Gobosh, everybody, from Apollo and the Fabulous Jimmy Band. Thank you, Johnny. Welcome, Sally. So, yeah, we got a first year out of the way getting the jitters out. Oh, man. So, hey, the one thing that I found out with all the research that we had done up on this record was that It's So Easy was actually the first single on the album, which I thought was really surprising. And uh, Night Train was actually the last single. So, uh, they, you know, obviously the big hits in between Welcome to the Jungle and Sweet Child of Mine and Paradise City. And there as well, and there, uh, those songs are coming up tonight. But uh, we move on to the second, third. And uh, I want you guys to welcome Mr. Paul Keen from the Pawn Shop.
can I get more Brian Quinn in guitar on my monitor? And also more of this vocal on my the drum
kind of fucking fun is illegal.
Alright, we're gonna let you, let you guys soak that one in. We're gonna take about five, ten minutes. We'll be right back. We're gonna come back with side two. We'll be right back. Don't go anywhere.